Are you tired of having to stare at your computer for so long? Well, this is the best solution to your problems. You can try planting different types of plants, fruits, and vegetables, which you can order from the internet. In order to plant the seed properly, you need the right materials, which are First, you need a pen or a pencil, a flower pot, some seeds, a shovel, some neutralized soil, and a watering can. In the end, if you perform the following steps correctly, this will be your result. Now, these are the procedures you can follow. First, you should dig at least 4 holes depending on the size of the pot and the neutralized soil. You should place at least two seeds or three seeds into each hole. Then you can cover the holes with the soil with your hands or also shovel. Finally, water your seed continuously and make sure that you water the plants or the seeds with the same amount of water each time. Additionally, make sure you wash your hands properly for at least 30 seconds while using soap like this. You should wear your mask properly when you go outside by placing the string around your ears and securing the nose with the mask by pinching it with your fingers. Also, make sure that you don't touch the interior part of the mask while you're putting it on for safety reasons and sanitary reasons. You can also put the mask into a container like a zip bag so that it doesn't get dirty when you don't use it. Another simple way to cure boredom is reading. If you can, turn on a reading lamp so it reduces the strain from your eyes. If you really like the book you're reading, time could go by and you wouldn't even know it. You can also bake with your family. It is very easy if you follow the instructions and when it's over, it will be really yummy. to show you how to make a jumping frog with paper. 
I recommend this because it's fun and it helps us be averted to our devices since we mostly spend our time looking at our devices. The materials needed for this is paper. First, fold your paper in half and then fold it again the other way to make a crease. Next, be sure to make the flaps be open on the right side and take the top right of both layers and fold it into the other outer left side. Do the same thing for the other side. After you open it up and you should have a triangle shape. Next, we need to make it so that it kind of collapses. By folding the creases first and then the section, make everything come into the center to make a triangle shape. Now take the bottom part and fold up the lines created. After, take these corners and it needs to fold underneath the leg part. And do this also to the opposite side. From here, take the flaps and fold them down to make little triangles. Be sure to give them some pressure when doing this. After, uh, we make the frog legs by taking the sides and folding it where you want it, but just remember that it needs to match up with the other leg. Then, take only the top layer and give it a gentle pull to make it come straight out. You should get a long shape of a triangle. This also to the other opposite side. Next, fold down to the crease of the legs. And that's the end of how you make a jumping frog. First, I'm going to show you how to fold your own clothes. The materials you'll need is only cardboard. First, uh, place the cardboard under the neckline and for fold it in order by sleeves and then fold, it, uh, fold the bottom hem so that it reaches the collar shoulder. Then. Take the cardboard out carefully and then you're done. You can fold it again if you want to. How to make a Korean sauna lamp. First get a towel and fold it and roll out the edge like this. I recommend rolling it two times and do this again to the other side as well. Now open it up and put it on your head 
once you're done. You can either play outside by yourself or with a friend. If you want to play something inside, you can play board games like The Game of Life or Monopoly. Thank you for watching.